Okay, guys and girls, Richard from Sharpshooting UK here. I've got my Calypso Mini AB on my tripod, and that is facing the target currently. So I want to show you, since my last video on the integration of the Calypso into various solvers, how um, there's been an update and the 901 is now behaving in an updated manner. So let me get you on here. Now let's get into some shade so you can see the screen. Right, I hate shooting screens, it's so... Right, here we go. Now, what I wanna show you, if you've watched my Calypso video, you'll note that I said on the Montana 710i and 760i, uh, you can go into environment and you can manually pull Okay, so that updates about every minute. But if you nip up to, I'm making a meal of this because I'm doing it one handed, but this is only actually about five seconds of button pressing. Turn your auto update off, okay? And then you can poll use Calypso data, which is new in the last week or so. Then you can manually get the wins. So we've got 26 win one, 26, win two, nice and steady, and wind direction from 318. So then, back on your main page, you have taken, say you've loaded your mag, and you want to um, you know, manually see if the wind has changed in the last few seconds. Rather than waiting for the one minute auto update, you can poll it manually, which you could only previously do in the Garmin Montana. So that's a nice little um, update. And what I'm finding is literally week by week, day by day, updates to the software are quietly coming in that make the system more advanced. For example, since I did my last video just a week ago on the Calypso integration into all the main solvers that I use here at, at Sharpshooting UK, um, an AB quantum update came out, which enables you to use north wind rather than relative to DOF. And what that essentially means is that you can point the Calypso to north all day and not have to point it to the target every time you change target. And you drive relative wind with your azimuth. So you see on here DOF. That is normally used, and you can see the details of this on my full ballistics course, which is going up on Patreon this week. But basically, DOF normally is to do with cancelling out the Coriolis, which is very important on the shots over about a second of flight time. So what it now does when you've got your wind meter facing north, which is called true wind direction rather than relative to DOF wind direction, in the uh, Garmin's, and uh, it's simply called North in the um, AB Quantum update. When you put in your DOF, it goes, right, well, if the wind is from zero degrees, for example, you're shooting 270, uh, because that's uh, your, your DOF um, informs us of that, then the wind is going to be relatively this. And then when you change target and you go, right, now I'm shooting 212 DOF, you don't have to move the wind meter around because it does it referencing north. So that is progress in that you don't have to get up each time and move the wind meter around. Now, I'm not advising people use it quite yet. Um, there are a couple of disadvantages which I discuss on my uh, online course on Patreon, but basically my point is week by week, they're enabling new features here. And the purpose of this video is to explain to you that you can now manually poll the Garmin Fortrex 901 um, in addition to the auto updating, which a week ago was only available on the Montana. OK, hope this helps. I think I'm going to keep up to date with the changes going on. I think sort of weekly videos, I'm on the hill four or five days a week shooting all day. So 
I'm using all these solvers all day and I'm very quickly seeing the new upgrades, especially with the AD Quantum app or, or being very new and, and being constantly upgraded and worked on. So I think I'll keep this series going and that should help people around the world who, who don't get to shoot with all the solvers every day of the week um, informed as to uh, what's the best way to skin the cat when it comes to these Calypsos and integration into the various solvers. Okay, hope this helps. All the best.